to the bell. Running back. Winning for high school. I have a pretty simple philosophy in life. It is never too early to start talking about football. After all, the new season, just four months away. In Suffolk County at William Floyd High School, the conversation typically begins and ends with defense. Last fall, Paul Longo's squad held their opponents to under 10 points per game. But over the next two years, the Floyd offense might start to grab the headlines. A sensational sophomore season has many wondering how good Stacy Bedell will get over the next two years. We recently caught up with Bedell as he gears up for his junior season. 73 yards for the When he hits a hole, if he just gets one step on everybody, he's gone. I'm a North South type running back. I like to do people and feed on my speed. I was a sophomore last year. It was a great experience for me to be able to start an offensive defense on varsity my first year. I had 869 yards, 10 touchdowns. Stacy's an explosive uh, running back, and uh, the beauty of it is he's the complete package. He is not only is he a great running back, but a great person. And he's super in the classroom. He's a great role model for younger players already, and he's only a 10th grader. And uh, his feet are unbelievable. He is so quick. Uh, he had such a great year for us last year. Already as a sophomore, he was all county, first team all county, first team all division. We had played St. Jim North, who had a real good team this year in the county championship game. And Stacy actually had like 170 yards, two big touchdowns, and was the MVP of the game. Him play Little League, you can see that he was uh, different. My first year in Little League, I was 10 years old. I had a paper home from the sign up for a football team. I was the only one that was new to the team. Everybody played the year before. I was kind of nervous. But then after I got the starting running back position, then I did good. My couple of years, I just wanted to continue playing football. You know, when guys are just running away from people with it, where the separation is becoming huge, and that's what you've seen with him, is that when he took off, uh, nobody could catch him on the field. He was above and beyond any of the players, even in Little League. Division 1A coach uh, look at his highlight film and uh, I just started showing him the film and after just a few plays the guy told me turn off the film uh, this guy's a 1A player. I'm gonna be a junior next year and I'm looking to prove that I'm gonna be one of the best running backs in the area. Stacy could carry us next year I and mean, he could just be that good as a junior and you know as a senior I, I don't even like to think about it get so excited I mean I can't imagine what a great player this guy's gonna be as a senior. Uh, 4 4 5 40 after just his sophomore season. And this team that, as he mentioned, known so much for their defense, they are going to be fantastic on the offensive side of the ball with Stacey Bedell running the football all year long. Absolutely. You know, I got to say, I'm digging the home videos from Little League. Do you see the little man? He's all like, <laughs> look out. <laughs> I love it. All right. Jared's philosophy it's never too early to talk about football, but.